What's up guys? Thank you so much for watching today's video. My name's Toby. You're watching the Upstate Pickers YouTube channel. And today we're going Funko Pop Funko Con 2021. We're going shopping. A lot of stores won't let me record in there. I don't know why, but we have some amazing pickups. We have an amazing pickup. We have a bunch of new pops and I can't wait to show you guys what we got. Stay tuned. I can't believe I'm doing this, but Toya got me up at 7 a.m. to go stand outside a store. <sighs> Unbelievable, literally four people already in there. That's crazy, man. There wasn't even anything in the store. Call for nothing, man. But, the early bird gets the early worm. I'm knocked out, went to Barnes & Noble, they had nothing, now we're at Hot Topic. Let's get it. We got a bunch of stuff. Missy's in there. You wanna say anything to the Upstate Pickers family? Hey, Sean. Any girls that wanna hit my line, I'm available. Yeah, well I want all those girls to know that I pay that line, so <laughs> you have to speak to me first. You got anything to say to the Upstate Pickers family? Yeah, all the idiots. <laughs> Wow, so you're gonna diss all my subscribers? I'm talking like, about YouTube. I was gonna take you to Queens Jewelers, but instead, I'm gonna take you to what Dollar Tree. Time. We're home. Okay, so we're back from the pickup. Um, GameStop had a really cool deal where if you bought a $5 bag, it would take 20% off your entire purchase. So what we ended up doing is, I ended up getting one of each, and the total was around $95, and with getting the bag, my total came out to be $75. So I saved around 20 bucks. So the first pop I wanna show you guys is the Stanley Hudson from The Office. So you guys can see. Super cool pop. He's wearing a super cool outfit. Um, the Office pops, I think this one will go up in value a lot. The Office pops are always worth a lot. Coming in next. Now this one may be my favorite. This one right here is hard. This is the Deathstroke Deadpool Funko Pop. And this thing looks amazing, guys. Look at that. Just look at him. I really, I really enjoy this pop. I mean, it's a 2021. This one came out at Target. And Target is supposed to come out with Bulbasaur diamond edition but we could not find him he was not in the store anywhere so we weren't able to get bubasaur but we picked him up this is a super cool pop guys i'm gonna be keeping this for my personal collection coming in next we have a super cool i predict that this pop right here will be worth a hundred dollars in about six months we have the white lantern and this pop you could just see the colors on this thing i mean the way the green and the purple the like the little purple color go to what it just goes so well together this pop right here is actually maybe other than the the death stroke this may be one of my favorite ones so this pop right here guys super cool and this was out of hot topic all you simpson fans this is the belly dancer simpson um there's more simpson fans than i've literally could ever imagine the this pop right here is super cool this was actually picked up at gamestop it was one of the last ones they had that I picked up. After Toya got back from GameStop, I, I went in there because I went to Target and I went to Barnes and Nobles and they had absolutely nothing. Apparently they put out the wrong date on their website. Or they're like, hey, yeah, everything's coming out today. Be there, blah, blah, blah. This is a release, this is how many we have. I'm like, okay, so I'm out there waiting. And then long story short, they're not even there. From Star Wars Rebels, we have the Imperial Super Commando. This is a super cool one, guys. This actually, maybe one of the more valuable ones as well as star Wars pops tend to skyrocket star Wars pops sometimes the, the right ones will go up in value this also was at gamestop so if you haven't got them yet guys you might want to hurry up now i know i said deathstroke was super fun but i think this may be my favorite pop and you guys probably will agree with me Squirtle Glitter Diamond Edition. Look, just look at him. I mean, this pop, it's just, this thing is just amazing. 
and you can see the condition. I ha I had the Vaporeon, or you guys can judge me all you want. I don't even know how to say it. Vaporeon, Vaporeon. I don't know how to say it, but I had him. I wish I would have kept on him because I sold him for forty bucks, and literally, he's worth one hundred and forty today. So. We'll be holding on to this guy. He looks awesome. And this guy right here, man, he is a big one. And I'm sure you know, if you know anything about Funcon 2021, you know what the bigger Funko was. And this beauty right here, look at him. For all you My Hero Academia fans, I will be selling this one. Fat Gum, super cool. My favorite character off there is Dobby. As you can see, the condition guy right, is super cool and he's big, man. Some things I just wanted to show you guys that we recently picked up as well. We have the Blue Spirit Chase Glow in the Dark Avatar Funko Pop. This thing, guys, is um, it, I don't know the the market value, like how long it's gonna last, but this thing is a grail in my opinion. The pop is in mint condition. It's so beautiful. We picked this up at Hot Topic, and another one that we picked up that's super cool that will be up for sale is this alice in wonderland two pack funko pop um comes with a t-shirt and the t-shirt is a size uh medium um factory sealed alice in wonderland flocked uh funko pop with the t-shirt bundle um this will be for sale uh i'll have the link in my description if you guys are interested in that and this was picked up at gamestop this was the naruto pack and it comes with the t-shirt and the funko pop i like how he's holding like the the sickle or the hatchet in his arm it looks like like that little thing right there and the shirt on this one is a size large so back with the funko con 2021 here we have the drummer mcnugget from mcdonald's this is a super cool ad icon um I'm not really big on ad icons, but I really do like like the Tony the Tigers and the Toucan Sams. But this guy just, it just looks funny. Or woman, I should say. It looks like a woman. Uh, who knows? Who knows what it is? We can't assume, right? This pop right here is, I'm pretty sure this one is from Hot Topic. It is a beauty. I really, I really enjoy that pop. I have another My Hero Academia pop. And this one right here, this may be one of the coolest pops I've ever seen. Just, it has a little scratch on the window right there, but Gang Orca. I'm sure that's how you pronounce it, right? This is the 2021 Summer Exclusive Edition from Funko Con from 2021. This is a Hot Topic release with the shared sticker. And I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's a little smudge right there. Really enjoy this pop. I may be holding on to him. Now this next one is a pop that is going to be for sale. This is the new Suicide Squad Funko Pop TDK. This will be for sale. I'm still trying to figure out some prices, but Suicide Squad, I'm not a real big fan of. I'm more of a big fan of like Joaquin Phoenix's Joker, The Dark Knight. Even Jack Nicholson's Joker was amazing. And Suicide was one of the worst movies in my opinion. So not really big a fan of the pop. So this one will be up for sale. This is a super cool Funko Pop. Doki Doki. This is super cool, guys. Uh, this one, I think, is, was one of the more valuable ones. I think you pronounce that Sabuchan. I can't even say it right. This Hot Topic only had three of them, so we made sure we were first in line. We got up super early. We had Also, another thing I want to mention, when we were doing these Funko Pop hunting, we had a very, very, very good route. It seemed like every store we went to, I dropped Toya off at GameStop, and then I went to Target, and then I went to Barnes & Nobles. As soon as I got done with that Hot Topic, was like 30 minutes before we opened, so we got there first. So it was a really good route. The Sabochan Funko Pop, this one will be for sale. Don't really know the prices on it. I know that it's a super cool pop. I may keep it. Last but not least, we have my personal favorite. And I, I keep saying this. I feel like this Funko Con, every pop, like they had so many good pops. So a lot of them are my favorite. So guys, this pop right here, I know I've said all of them are my favorite because honestly, this con had so many great pops, but right here, this pop may be the best one. And this is the Semi Samurai Jack Demongo pop. And this thing looks sick. I don't know if you guys can see him, but he's holding a skull in his hand. Man, and it just, the color on this pop is amazing. 
And so what Target was doing is they were allowing two units per customer. So we, I ended up getting two units. Me and Toy both got two units. Keeping one, we're keeping one for our collection. We're selling the rest. If you guys want this, it will be for sale. Also, guys, just want to let you guys know, if we can get this video to 1,000 views and 100 likes, I will be doing a giveaway with the Avatar Blue Spirit Chase Hot Topic Exclusive Glow in the Dark Ship Same Day for free giveaway on this YouTube channel. 1,000 views and 100 likes. I will be giving this bad boy away. So you guys know what to do, man. You guys just gotta make it happen. And here's a look at the GameStop bag that they give you, or that you, they give you, you have to buy. It's a $5 bag. It's cool that it has PlayStation on it because who doesn't like PlayStation? Xbox, you Xbox losers out there. Yeah guys, that really wraps up everything we got. There's still more Funkos that we're gonna go out and try to hunt and get. The Funko shop, Funkos that were online within, I, I promise you not, I had like 15 pops. I had a lot of pops. I had the, the Captain America die cast. I had a bunch of pops in there. The Alice in Wonderland pop that was blacklight. So many things. I get them in my car, I go to check out everything sold out so that's usually how it is guys with people you know 6 a.m uh pacific standard time that's 9 a.m for me and i'm ready i'm locked and loaded and as soon as i check out they're all sold out so that's usually how it goes though you just you, sometimes you're lucky i really enjoyed doing this haul video if you guys like this video make sure to leave a like comment down below what fuck up pops that you guys picked up and I, I really want to know if you guys like the format because I'm trying to do more formats on my videos where I kind of, you know, show you guys what I get and everything. So as always, tell someone you love them. I'll see you guys in the next one.